Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing a game called Call of Unity. Yesterday I went on Steam, I bought a bunch of games for under 50p. This game, Call of Unity, costs 39p. It's a first person shooter and I personally think if you're just starting out with FPS you should take a light easy game where you respawn every second just to get used to playing with a keyboard and mouse. At the moment it appears to be an online game. Select region. So where I am is not on this game. So I'm gonna go, I guess Amsterdam is close. After selecting browse game, nothing showed up on the server, which suggests that not a lot of people are playing this game. Absolutely nothing. Do quick play. Map one, game mode, do deathmatch, fine. To my surprise, it took me to this screen. I have to pick between two teams, and it appears to be online against other people. Let's see how it does. Okay, so I'm in game. Spawn protection is on, and I get killed almost immediately into the game. Not a great start. Oh my word, this is chaotic already. Right, I think I've got three kills in. As you can see, it's an absolute free for all. As soon as I aim at someone, they're already being hit by somebody else's bullet. It's actually quite a fun game to play, as long as you don't take dying too seriously. It's a nightmare. The only criticism I have so far of deathmatch mode is everybody is your enemy, yet they respawn at the same place as you. So if you respawn in front of somebody, you have an immediate disadvantage just because of where you respawn. Like I said at the beginning, if you want an easy, quick flowing game, just so you can learn to play first person shooters on keyboard and mouse, I think this is definitely an option. Hey, hey, easy, easy. Ah, say hello to my little friend. That was not my proudest moment. So, we lost the match. I'm a bit confused why there were teams when it was a free-for-all death match and how the teams worked. But it cost 39p, so I'm not complaining. It was definitely fun. I will play it again. Now, let's go and take a look at some of the reviews. So off the bat, we're getting a lot of thumbs up, but the review is negative. Yeah. So this seems like a game that people love to hate. This game is awfully coded. Looks are worse than a mobile game, but it's the hardest I've laughed in weeks. It is horrible. Please buy it. I don't, I don't know what people expect for the price. Bad, bad recommended. Good game. What is going on? And if you're comparing a 39p game to a game that has a huge budget, you're never gonna be satisfied. You might as well not buy a 39p game to begin with. Okay, that is all for the video. Thank you for watching. If you've played this game before, I'd like to hear what your opinions are in the comments section. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you for watching.